hi guys welcome to another video welcome to another vlog thank you for stopping by if this is your first time on this channel please click on the like button subscribe and share in today's video i will be talking about things skills that you should have before you relocate to the united kingdom guys i don't know how to emphasize this enough you need these skills to be able to survive financially <laughs> in the uk it's a side hustle obviously you can do it full time if you want but these skills would provide you know in a bit of cash here and there here and there that you could help you in the long run so i thought i'd just do this video to let people know that guys your skill is not wasted if you have any of these skills or even skills that i haven't even thought about or mentioned in this video there is no such thing as a wasted skill in the uk especially if you can do anything you can do with your hands so number one skill that you should have before relocating to the uk is tailoring tailoring guys i don't know where the party hub is if it's in lagos nigeria or london it's i don't know who does parties more <laughs> i don't know where the party is if it's here or in nigeria but what i do know is that there's always an event happening here there's always something happening it could be a wedding naming ceremony graduate it doesn't matter what it is there's always something happening and yeah we are always short of um um tailors we need tailors see as long as you can advertise yourself even if it's on instagram facebook tiktok wherever it is just advertise yourself put your location tell people that you can make clothes and also word of mouth just church members tell your church members your colleagues at work um your you know classmates wherever you see any african person self just tell them ah, i'm making clothes you will always eat there is always food available for you no <laughs> skill is cooking cooking skills if you know how to cook and i mean proper proper cook um cook properly oh, nice food you can cook properly then there's always a, a customer for you there's always someone out there that needs your service so it could be you know catering services you know you can cook for an event or you can even cook for individuals um a cousin of mine she used to cook for men families especially men um in london you know or just bachelors or married men or divorcees or whatever they she she always makes food for them and she you know she was um charging them uh, quite quite a bit quite a bit she had custom in fact at one point she was like oh, i'm tired i beg i don't want too much people too many people so there's never too many people um in this business there is it there's no such thing as too many people you will always have your custom you can bake as well things like chin chin pop off um meat pie you know small chops things like that for events guys you are fine you are fine uh, the next skill is hairdressing or hair making skill should i just say hair making skill hairdressing and also I'll slash it with barber barbering <laughs> that's a word barbering <laughs> if you know how to make hair see there is always someone out there that needs your service there's not such thing as oh you know there's people doing already in my area I haven't got that many people that make hair there are a few how are those few still have too many customers that they're even doing shakara they'll be shakara for us you call one person oh i'm slightly busy call the other day you have to book in advance in advance before you can even get your hair done so it doesn't matter where you go there's an uh, in fact even knowing what people get their hair braided and so there's always someone somewhere that needs your service and if you also know how to cut hair again advertise yourself 
put it online, talk to your colleagues, your church members, your mosque members, doesn't matter, just open your mouth and advertise yourself. Advertise yourself and yeah, there's always someone out there. Um, the next one is makeup and gilly. This one, makeup, in fact, like I said, there's always something happening. There's always an event. There is always an event. So don't worry about not having customers. They are there. The beautiful ladies are there that want to get their face made up. They are there and they will pay. Now, I'm not saying charge too, too much, but you will always have a customer. There's always someone. And also for Gailey, all you need to do for yourself is just go to a place where they're having parties, a hall. Someone is doing a party down the street. Just go. I can't remember. I don't know how much they charge for Gele. Per Gele. Per, <laughs> per Gele. <laughs> yes, per Gele. Per Gele. I don't know how much they charge for it. It could be, it could be five pounds, ten pounds. I'm not sure. But whatever. Even if it's five pounds. If you tie like ten. It won't. Is that not fifty pounds? So the next skill is handyman skills. This one, do I even need to, do I even need to go into it? And demand skills. Hmm. Guys, there are a million and one people looking for handymen in the United Kingdom. They are always looking for somebody. In fact, uh, yesterday I went onto uh, a Facebook page um, that I'm a part of and I'm a yeah, member of the group and Everything that they had was uh, looking for someone that can fix a shelf or looking for someone that can fix a garage door, looking for someone that can do this, this, this. So if you have any of these skills, the carpentry skills, especially carpentry skills, there's always someone looking for someone to hang something up in, a door handle is fall off or it's, just put yourself on Gumtree, put yourself on Gumtree and say, you know, you've got the skill, uh, if anyone is looking for you know a handyman with this skill put your number there they will call you another thing is event planning event um anchor so if you can do like mc if you can talk you can talk you can anchor an event um event yeah decor you can do decoration of halls and stuff like that there, there is, there is uh, money there as well. There is money there. You know, there's always people that need your help. Um, there's always someone that needs your service. Come, and uh, whatever they're called. If you know how to do these things, if you can talk and make people laugh, you know, if you're funny, then yeah, guys, just, just, just advertise yourself. Just advertise yourself. You know. Just let people know that you've got the skill and you know you're looking for jobs. I don't know. It's a skill actually. Uh, musical instruments. Musical instruments. Most especially the drums. If you can lulu, you can lulu go go and whatever the drum it is that they do. A friend of my husband, he drums and they always call him for events. All the time. Monday. Friday, it doesn't matter what day of the week it is. So, and sometimes it only goes for like an hour. Sometimes he only says, he will say something like, oh, I'm just going in to just uh, drum for the brides are dancing, the bride and the bride's family. And he'll get money. Like, and I'm saying like proper, proper money. So it's the, the jobs that people don't want to do are probably considered like, you know, uh, menial jobs in Nigeria that is making money here. Ishiawa makes money here. Handwork makes money here. They make money. You be competing with somebody. In fact, people that work in an office, some of us that work in an office, compared to someone that you know is a painter, you'll be seeing them buying houses, you know, renovating these houses by themselves and reselling it. They make money. They make money. Don't be looking at them and thinking they don't have money. You see them in their Yamayama clothes. They have money. They have money. Don't look down on them. So if you have those skills, and I'm not saying that coming here and this is what you need to do, but obviously it's it's an option. 
you know you can do it as part-time like i keep saying it doesn't have to be your full time this is for the ladies or men if you, men also they make hair if you know how to do this uh sister locks sister locks let me even say for myself i'm looking for somebody that knows how to do sister locks if you live around brighton area and you know how to do sister locks please leave a comment in the comment section i am looking to lock my hair <laughs> however if you do know how to do it and you're thinking about relocating to the uk from anywhere in africa or even anywhere if you are relocating from spain to the wherever it is and you know how to do sister locks please leave a comment leave a comment and please advertise yourself advertise yourself because that's the thing now sister locks is the thing that you know everyone's going natural so everyone likes to what's to lock their hair myself included why i have not found someone close to me that can do it everyone is in london and it's way too far from me. the last but not the least is obviously a uh, content creator it's content creator instagram youtube um tiktok is the thing now even facebook self some people are still on it and people are making money on it i don't know how people make money guys because i am also new to this youtubing <laughs> i'm not making money yet so i'm new to it however from what we've heard people make money from it so if you are uh, you know if you're if you move in here with your spouse uh say women for example and you're gonna be at home for a while even if it's just making hair record it and put it on youtube even if it's just cooking record it and put it on youtube like people like my mom she watch this video self <laughs> she probably laugh she always says to me she says abby do you know the things that i have watched on youtube <laughs> Do you know the things that we find somebody just driving motorcycle there's a guy that we watch on um on youtube he just drives his motorcycle and from one place in nigeria to another place if we, i even enjoy watching it even me he doesn't talk i don't know who he is but i'm like oh my god i know that area oh my god like the things that we have watched on this youtube because data is not that expensive it's inexpensive so it's not like nigeria where you have they say you have unlimited but then you know after like two weeks it's gone here yeah, unlimited is unlimited so you can watch as many videos on youtube as you want so if you can create content there's no such thing as terrible content and so yeah um so if you have the time in fact you can record you can your children can be your content this is we in this life where you know in the 21st century where everything is content as they say on everything is content don't forget to film it don't forget to film it. <laughs> everything is content. so if you know how to do that that's one also and then you know content creating it it's quite broad it doesn't have to be that it could be you know you creating content for a business you know it could be you creating content for you know an individual it, it it varies it depends it's different thing it could be you talking about your life it could be you talking about your life in the uk you know or your life in nigeria you know your life in general it doesn't matter if you can create content that's you know that's the thing that is selling is the hot cake right now hence why we're dipping into it as well so please guys please 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 I beg una, na beg at the beg me shako. I am not doing shakara right now. Please subscribe, <laughs> subscribe to this to my channel, and I hope you've enjoyed this video, and I'll see you in my next one.